Hello friends, welcome to your own. हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू योर ओन चैनल लेट्स स्टडी विद रिचा आज हम डिस्कस करेंगे पेडागॉजी ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस के कॉन्सेप्ट को तो अगर आपने चैनल को लाइक को सब्सक्राइब ना किया हो तो जरूर कर लीजिएगा और नोटिफिकेशन बेल को प्रेस कर देना तभी आपको वीडियो की नोटिफिकेशन मिल जाएगी जब भी अपलोड होगी और लाइक जरूर कर दिया करो वीडियो को चलिए अभी हम डिस्कस करते हैं हमारा पेडागॉजी ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस का जिसमें हम आज पढ़ेंगे कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस एंड ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस एंड इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस ठीक है तो चलिए हमारा टॉपिक हम स्टार्ट करते हैं फर्स्ट इज कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस देखिए कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस में क्या आएगा कंप्यूटर साइंस एक्चुअल में होती क्या है कंप्यूटर साइंस इज अ फील्ड ऑफ स्टडी दैट फोकसिस ऑन द प्रिंसिपल मैथड्स एंड थ्योरीज दैट अंडर इन द डिजाइन डेवलपमेंट एंड यूटिलाइजेशन ऑफ कंप्यूटर इफ आई आस्क यू यू ऑल आर दूडेंट्स ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस सो इफ आई आस्क यू just give me the one example of application where last in first out system is used in our daily life just think and answer and if you it's it will be good if you will write in the comment box do you know the real example the application of last in first out lipo system in real world or first in first out systems application in the real world maybe most of the students are uh, most of the students don't know where these are used so what is computer science computer science is a field of study which focuses on to know the principles methods and theories that underpin the design development and utilization of computers not only just the theory knowledge but also their practical knowledge where they will be used how they will be used and how the changes could be made and the they can be used in the future okay so computer science aims to understand both the theoretical as i told you to theoretical foundation and the practical application okay both uh, uh, to understand both the uh, 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 the theory part and the practical application okay that is known as the computer science computer science encompasses a wide range of disciplines including disciplines like algorithm ab algorithm banayenge to usme aapko step pata hone chahiye na ki rectangle box kis liye use hoga uh, jo aapka square box hai wo kis liye use hoga diamond kis liye use hoga aur fir जो आप स्टेप्स लिख रहे हो दैट स्टेप्स शुड बी इन व्हाट मैनर ओके सो दीज आर द डिसिप्लिन एल्गोरिदम डाटा स्ट्रक्चर प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेजेस आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस कंप्यूटर ग्राफिक्स क्रिप्टोग्राफी नेक्स्ट इज ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस द प्राइमरी ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस इज टू डेवलप एंड एडवांस नॉलेज एंड टेक्निक्स फॉर एफिशिएंट एंड इफेक्टिव कंप्यूटेशन दिस इंक्लूड्स डेवलपिंग एल्गोरिदम एंड डाटा स्ट्रक्चर टू सॉल्व कॉम्प्लेक्स प्रॉब्लम्स देखिए हाउ Uh, any person who who will get the problem how will they solve it first of all they will analyze the problem think about the steps these steps in a particular way are called the algorithms right and then the data structure will be used to solve the problems complex problems then designing programming languages how they will write the program they will think about the programming language that could be the best solution of that problem right and systems to facilitate software development ab jab aapka sara program ban gaya theek hai then after you need a software in which you can you can uh, use these like these particular programs so creating models and methods for artificial intelligence and machine learning and ensuring the security and privacy of the computer system so this is the main objective of computer science that whenever the problem is given to any of the person that time how will they start to solve the problem the steps that will be included in that you can uh, what the what the steps will be to uh, designing the programming language the systems facilitate software development and the what changes are required to maintain the flexibility of the software and of the program okay then after creating the models to show the working of the particular program or the particular software that they are going to design because okay, so this uh, this all is the objective of the computer science importance of computer science now why it is important definitely exam specific skills efficiency and accuracy problem solving learning and retention career opportunities interdisciplinary applications and maybe many more there will be many more importance of computer science so let's discuss in detail exam specific skills like they include problem solving logical reasoning critical thinking problem solving skills logical reasoning critical thinking and analytical abilities these skills are highly transferable and can be applied to various subjects and exam formats see if you are having computer knowledge then definitely you can do the mathematical and account related solutions problems in 
uh, MS Excel or any open office software, right? Or you can create the Google Sheets, right? If you have to work with the, uh, if you are working in a corporate office and you need to share the data with, the, uh, in which you are giving permission to many of your colleagues. So exam specific skills for that computer science is important. Next point is efficiency and accuracy. So efficiency means that uh, if any time you need any, you want to do any change, then your algorithm, your program, your structure should be flexible. Okay, accuracy means whatever the problem you are giving, it is giving you the solution. Next is learning and retention. By understanding how our brains process information, computer science can help students develop effective study techniques such as paste, repetition, concept mapping. They will try to remind the steps in their mind. Why? Because they are doing step by step. The students who are getting the problem in memorization of the concept, it will be very much beneficial. Like you can do the, uh, if I'll take example of any of the subject, you can write like uh, the SST science and you're finding the concepts are difficult. You want to do written practice, but you don't want to do. What do you will do? You will use the algorithm. You know? Just create the picture, uh, pictorial information. Or do, you can do one more thing that, um, you can type in MS, uh, in MS Word or you can create a program of any language if you're having knowledge. So you can retain, you can learn the concepts. Next is technological advancements. Computer science drives technological innovations, obviously. So for example, the AI techniques, right? You are using the computers for your worksheets, for your practice or for concepts. Next is problem solving. Computer science equips individuals with problem solving skills, it involves analyzing complex problems, designing algorithm and developing solutions using logical and critical thinking. It make you logical thinker and problem solver. Why? Because whenever you are trying to solve, you are thinking of that if you have skipped any step, because if you want this thing, then you need that thing. Okay. So this is the problem solving technique. But in opportunity, there are a vast, a wide, range of opportunities in the computer science field. Like the cyber security, artificial intelligence, data analysis, software development, SDLC, and uh, many more. Next is innovation and creativity. Obviously, with the computer knowledge of computer science, you can create your own websites, you can create your own AI world, you can enhance the your growth of your business, right? So it will make you innovative and creative. Digital literacy, understanding computer science principles is uh, essential for digital literacy in the modern world. It enables individuals to navigate and utilize technology effectively, making them more empowered and informed users. Computer science education helps individuals become familiar with digital concepts like coding algorithm. Obviously, if I will, think, if I will start, take the concept of uh, coding, like Scratch, Code.org, these are so user-friendly. Any of the student who is not having any of the knowledge of the programming, even they can start to create the game or the app. So digital literacy also enhanced by the computer science knowledge. Interdisciplinary applications. Computer science has interdisciplinary application, meaning it can be integrated and applied across various fields. For example, uh, computer science techniques are used in fields like biology, environmental science. Uh, tell me one thing, give me name of any of one field where you cannot use computers none in every field you can use or you I, i'll say the better you can make that field better with the help of computers okay so this interdisciplinary approach enables innovative solutions and collaborations between computer scientists and professionals from different domains data analysis and decision making with the explosion of data in today's world Computer science plays a crucial role. See, why I heard this point is important, data analysis, because now in this world, uh, in this, I'll say competitive world, okay, all students uh, want to get the government job, but there's so much uh, uh, competition that it's very difficult to get the competition, uh, to get the government job. So what they are thinking, if they will not get job, private, private job or uh, the government job, then what they will do? Definitely, they will start their own work, right? So, for that also, to start any of the business, they need any data. What is the demand of that particular thing, particular 
product that you want to start about the business and uh, uh, what uh, how much is how much supply is needed right and what will be the cost how will you manage it so data in, in data analysis computer science plays a crucial role and also decision making because uh, when you are having the clear picture pictorial information of the complete data then you it will be very much uh, it will be very much easy for you to find out the particular solution next is the content you can read yourself i'll just explain you the concept so conclusion what could be conclusion conclusion is very important part of your question see in uh, in bed especially when we are writing the concept uh, answer of any of the question conclusion means you are conclu concluding whatever you have written so in summary computer science is important because it drives technological advances offers numerous career opportunities drives problem solving skills foster innovation enables digital literacy has interdisciplinary applications and provides data analysis capabilities embracing computer science education and skills can empower individuals to thrive in the digital era and contribute to the advancements of the society so this was the conclusion of this particular question of concept of computer science uh, objectives or the importance of the computer science clear so if you have uh, having any doubt or you want any further information about this topic please comment it i'll try to provide it and if you have not subscribed my channel subscribe it and press the notification bell only then you will get the notifications like and subscribe my video thank you so much